say there's an awful lot of pull in the news these days, but this is a really meaty story, one I could truly get my teeth into. It was Mart Day in Ballinrobe. People were going about their shopping and coming super value when suddenly the doors burst open. He came in the front door, straight into the store, turned around, had a good look and straight back out the door again. And I couldn't believe my eyes. And I could see people backing up and I said, oh yeah, definitely something's collapsed into something spent. And I just kept following it around and I could sort of smell them all. And <laughs> then I came up with a little crowd just over there. And, um, and I went in, I could see that was just as the bull was charging back out again and I never moved so fast, I was like, yeah. <laughs> Within a split second, a big huge bang, which no matter what it was first. But the next thing we saw, we saw the bullock going out again and the poor farmer running. <laughs> what about the poor farmer? He was coming in trying to get him and next thing he ran as well because he took off down the aisle and scared the daylights out of everyone. Came the whole way from the mark up through the whole of the town in here out of here and went up to Camille Road and the lads put him into a field. Could have been such a, a bad luck story, somebody could be hurt so much, damaged and everything else, to get away so lightly is unbelievable, you know? Because not every day people can say they have fresh beef in a shop as fresh as that. <laughs> Obviously a bowl of great taste that he came to your shop and not any of the others. Well he passed out Tesco tomorrow to us, so I think that says a lot more <laughs> our value than we have in super value. Eileen Agner, RT News, Bull and Roll, sorry, Bull and Roll, County Mayo.